So let's keep on going. And uh, you never know what we might find here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I know there's a spirit of a woman who is an actress who fell ill here and went across the street to the Belmont. God, I feel like something's gonna jump out at me. made it to the Abbeville Opera House. So, hey guys, you guys wanna do your explore first and then I'll do my explore afterwards and then we can compare what happened. That works. Dude, this place is awesome. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna be uh, outside and what you gonna give me, like an hour, 45 minutes? Yeah. All right, I'll be outside when you're done. All right, I gotta upload a video anyways outside, so. And then I'll do an all alone explore in there. But a big shout out to the Abbeville Opera House. Such a cool place. Check out in the description. If you guys come to Abbeville, make sure you guys check out the events and stuff they have here. And I'm sure you guys would love to come in here. It is amazing. She gave us a tour around the whole place. And uh, I decided I'm gonna let the South Cags do their video first. And then I'm gonna do my video next. That way we're not making noise for each other. And you know, if we hear noise, we know it's not them, <laughs> you know? So it's been a little over an hour, and I'm assuming that uh, they got some cool stuff on camera. I'll see you guys back at the hotel. All right, All right so we're gonna check this out. <laughs> no, Genevieve definitely don't want you to get me, but Genevieve, I would love to talk to you. So if you're here, anything you'd like to say or do, if you'd like to show yourself, I'd love to, to see you. So, back in the early 1900s, y'all saw the light flicker, right? Weird. The Abbeville Opera House was built in 1908, and it was used for like traveling shows and things like that. Now, they had a performance here one night, and there was an actress, for some reason, I cannot find the name. They don't know the name here. I'll have to ask at the Belmont, which is right across the street, but she came to perform and she was feeling ill. So she ended up going onto the second floor and watching half the show and she just did not feel well. So she went back to the Belmont Inn and fell asleep and she died in her sleep. Now they say her spirit haunts this place. I was told that the most active place here is on the third floor and also in the prop and dressing rooms. There is a basement which I'm excited to go to. And uh, let's just do it. Can I go this way? No, I can't. Actually, I can't go this way. Ooh. Lazy. Okay, now this is going to be one of the most interesting spots here. And this is the dressing room area. Now they say her apparition has been seen here in the dressing room area as well as on the second floor. And I'm excited to check this out. So that's the stage. And here we go in the dressing rooms. Never actually been in a real uh, dressing room. Is there any spirits in here with us? That's a cute little tiny dressing room. 
I like that. A little tarlet. We're gonna definitely go up, and we're definitely gonna go down soon. I probably should have brought my light, but that'd be okay. Wow, what cool dressing rooms. No way. Whoa, whoa. Is that you? What the hell? Dude, I'm shaking right now. Dude, are you kidding me? That makes me think the basement's gonna be really crazy. Oh, dude, that's weird. Can you do it again? Can you close that door again? Or open it, whatever it was. Oh man. Whew. Please shut door. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. All right. Going into the dungeon. that some just flew up oh oh maybe it's just dust Wait. yeah it's probably just, it's just dust Whew, it got me there for a second is there any spirits down here in the basement I'm not a duck. whoa that is crazy it's just dust though it's just dust I think all these uh, costumes and stuff. This is amazing. Wow. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the hell was that? Maybe this is like an old dressing room? Yeah, I'll tell you what, if you could just know more about the history here. These walls could talk, I tell you. It could be crazy. This is so cool. I know there's a spirit of a woman who was an actress who fell ill here and went across the street to the Belmont. God, I feel like something's going to jump out at me. <laughs> What the f What? What was that? What the hell? God, I have such a heavy feeling. I have such a like pressure in my chest right now. I don't know what the hell that was. Whoa, what is in here? Oh my gosh. Oh, we are really in the basement now.
Oh, oh my God, I'm shaking. Why am I shaking so much? What is in here? Oh, that's really cool. Don't you freaking dare. Don't do it again. Don't you dare. Oh my gosh. Guys, there's probably a lot that I'm gonna miss in this video. Like, there's apparitions that are seen in here. If you guys see anything that I miss, make sure you comment the timestamp and exactly what you saw. Because I have a feeling, uh, I mean, I've only been here a short time and I've already caught a lot of crazy stuff. Wow. This is so crazy. I don't know, guys. It's not many times that I'm lost for words. Y'all know that. Oh my God, I did not see that. Okay. All right, I think we're gonna get out of the basement. I think we've seen enough in here. Okay. Time to duck again. Time to duck and go through here. It's a good thing there's nobody behind me filming, if you know what I mean. All right, we'll keep this door closed. So since doors like to close on their own here, We checked out the dressing rooms in the stage. Let's go up to the second floor where the actress fell ill. Is it? I don't know why I cannot catch my breath here. Wait, why does this look exactly the... Wait, what? Wait. Huh? I guess these dressing rooms don't go to anywhere. Okay, so this is definitely a different dressing room, so let's keep on going. And uh, you never know what we might find here. Take my hat back, thanks. Now we're back on the other floor, but how the hell, how do we get back into the theater? I guess you gotta go down again? So, okay, I guess there's three floors that look similar. Okay, we made it out. All right, so that's one staircase. Ah, oh, this is the staircase we need to take. What was that? All right. Let's keep going. Check this out. Okay, so we're back in the theater here. And we're gonna go up these stairs. Come say hello. So far, that basement is by far the most haunted. Oh, check this out. Box seats, heck yeah. This is where I'm gonna be watching the show. Ah, oh, yeah. I like that. Remain seated on entering the balcony box. Do not set drinks, items on the ledge. Yeah, I wonder how many people have bloop, spilled their drink down on the patrons down there. I guarantee that's happened. All right, guys, so this is the second floor. And then that's the third floor. Now the third floor they do not use. Um, back in the days it was used for segregation. And I just seen an orb, I think, because there's no dust in here. You have to let me know. But somewhere up there is a chair that no one sits in. And it's for the actress who died. So let's go check it out. If you're here, I'm friendly. Just came to say hello. And visit with you. Oh man. I 
Are you up here on the second floor? sits in that was your chair right there huh are you up here with us if you are don't be afraid chairs over here so maybe that wasn't her chair I know one of these three chairs is hers I'm assuming it's that one over there so I know there's a staircase oh it's one of these doors that's not the right door. Yes. Now this goes up to the third floor. Now they told me it's not safe up on the third floor, so I don't think we'll be walking around up there, but let's go check it out. I did look at some news articles, and they claim that the third floor is the most haunted. So I'm really curious to see if we catch anything on the third floor. up here with us. I don't know what that noise was. Whoa. What was that? <sighs> Guys, I'm, I don't know why I'm so out of breath. It's like I was fine and I don't know. There's just something, something off. It's the actress who passed away at the Belmont who performed, is she here? If you are, can you walk on these floors? seat. This must be like the premium right here. I like that. Oh, this is cool. Oh, we're back on stage here. This is apparently one of the tallest brick structures in all of uh, South Carolina right here. If you look at the size of that wall, it's just ginormous way up there but um 
I guess they're practicing right now for a holiday uh, event, which is cool. So if you come out here to Abbeville, you go check out the Belmont Inn. If you want to come here and check out the awesome Abbeville Opera House. Uh, in the description, I have their website. It also lists uh, like a bunch of different uh, events and plays and musical shows that they do here. Um, I'd be curious how it is when there's a bunch of people here. I guess you probably couldn't hear much, huh? But what an absolutely amazing place, guys. Big shout out again here to the Abbeville Opera House for letting us come in and film here in the middle of the day, last minute. Just absolutely amazing. And I think now it's time for me to get back to the Belmont Inn because I got a video to film over there. All right. What an amazing place. Oh man, look at this town. I mean, it's just gorgeous. Just absolutely gorgeous. And right there, right on this corner is the Belmont Inn where we're staying tonight, where the actress actually passed away in her sleep. So this definitely should be interesting. Big shout out again to the Abbeville Opera House and a big thank you to Emily for allowing us to come in last minute. It was, uh, it was, you guys seen, that was pretty cool. And uh, yeah, I don't know what to expect because that place is haunted. This place is supposed to be even more haunted. This is where she actually died, so. Appreciate you guys watching. You guys are the best. I love you guys. Until next time, peace, yeah.